Hi, I'm Brian Emel. I'm singing Rodolfo here in Atlanta Opera's production of La Boheme. It's the first time that I'm singing the role, and it's the first time that I'm here in Atlanta working. I'm from New Orleans, so it's nice to be back down, down in the South and um, <coughs> enjoying the friendly people and the wonderful opera company that we have here in Atlanta. Matt, uh, who is singing Colline, he and I uh, were at Loyola University together in New Orleans. Andrew Garland, uh, he and I worked together in Boston a couple years ago. And then Tim Kuhn, uh, we have lots of mutual friends, although we haven't worked together before and we've just had a great time, the, uh, the four of us, uh, enjoying the music. We have a good time giving each other a hard time. Um, and then yet when it gets serious, it gets very real. Especially in Act 4 when here we are having a great time dancing and pretend fighting and such and all of a sudden Musetta busts in and says Mimi's here um, and she's not doing so well. So, um, I mean, Puccini was a master of, of drama and this kind of stuff. Grazia is wonderful. She's so kind. She's so sweet. And she's a perfect Mimi. Uh, you know, has a little sparkle in her eye. Um, but it's kind of reserved, and you see that um, in, in the way the character is written, and just the, it's just, yeah, it's perfect. It's perfect casting. This is the first time that I've worked uh, with David Gately. I have had friends that worked with him. He came to Academy of Vocal Arts, where I went to school in Philadelphia, and directed a Don Pasquale there that was uh, very, very successful. David Gately's done a great job of filling every little moment for every character so that there's nobody just standing around waiting for your next line to sing. It's so realistic, it's so uh, just completely thought of from every angle. Even if you're not a big opera fan, and you come in, you have a youthful cast, and you have a really well done production, then I think people will be more inclined to say that was, you know, that was there was something really nice there. Um, the fun and then also the drama. You'd be hard pressed to find someone to come to this show and leave not having a newfound respect for opera and what's happening and how fun it can be.